part. I'd like to turn to another point, and that has to do with um, the World Bank and the IMF and the influence of communist China. Last month, the law firm of Wilma Hale released findings from its investigation into data irregularities with the important World Bank doing business reports. These reports bill themselves as providing objective measures of business regulations for local firms in some 190 economies. The report found that the data describing the business climate in China was changed because of pressure by then World Bank CEO, Kristalina Georgieva. Her goal evidently was to inflate China's ranking at precisely the time that China was going to help the World Bank increase its capital, a clear conflict of interest. Despite legitimate issues and concerns, the Biden administration continues to support Dr. Georgieva to continue to lead the IMF. So, Deputy Secretary, what steps is Treasury taking to ensure that the World Bank and the IMF are safeguarded against corruption by the Chinese Communist Party? Senator, when we reviewed the Wilmer Report, we saw issues that were of serious concern, and that's why the Secretary um, demanded that the IMF look into this closely um, by speaking to the lawyers from Wilmer Hale and speaking with the managing director. Uh, the, based on the evidence that we reviewed, the, we did not find that it was appropriate at this point to remove the managing director, but we did, we did make very clear during those meetings and directly to the managing director that changes need to be made to ensure that whistleblowers' rights are protected that the integrity of the institutions are protected, which is our overarching goal, and that we will be holding her and the other leaders of the international financial institutions accountable for making these changes. Well, I think the Wilmer Hell report highlighted clear concerns about conflict of interest, and I hope that you will continue to work with us to ensure transparency as you hold the IMF and the World Bank and agencies like this accountable to prevent their malign, or them from being influenced by malign actors like the Chinese Communist Party. We're committed to working with you on that, Senator. Thank you very Thanks, much. Thanks, Senator Haggerty. Uh, Senator Cortez Mastow from Nevada is recognized for